What is going on, brothers and sisters? Welcome back to Dredge. And speaking of grieving fathers, what does he want? Is everything okay? You know of any shipwrecks around here? Well, yes, you see, my only son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks all alone in the cold, dark water. He's trying to remain composed. I was wondering, I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed on your ves vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. He wore a bronze belt buckle, specially engraved. I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Okay. Do you know anything? I don't get out anymore. Do you recommend the old mayor? Screaming and throwing things in the ocean. Throw it back, he would cry. Interesting. Interesting. No, that's it. That's all I need from you. What time is it? 6 a.m. It's a fresh day. What's in my boat? Nothing. Okay. Cabin. Oh, we've completed some of our our summer reading here. So now all rods will reel fish in 10% more effectively. Let's get the correct engine operation going. Let's also undock. So we do know behind little Maro over here is a ship. Or not a ship, but a, a wreck for us to explore. So let's head to the back and just make that our priority today. I don't want to get too involved in all this extra stuff. Put this out here. Like blue mackerel. We need to get coastal fishing going, but we got a dredge. I'm assuming I'm either going to get stuff from completing quests, finding new people to become friends with. Great, e great eel. Yeah, I've already gotten those. Is that something? I can't dredge the shore. It, it's gleaming. Inspect. You pull a little closer. Let's look inside. Oh, baby, a citrine ring. Let's take this. Yeah, I can't just click it over. We'll grab some lumber. I'll do it like this, I suppose. And then we got, as we were talking about research parts, we got it. And then an old iron chain junk to the untrained eye, but there's good metal here. Someone might pay for this. Okay. That was some interesting lightning over there. Obviously some shipping there. Gold flounder in the shallows here. We'll, we'll hit up fishing on the way back as an auxiliary. That's stingray. So, is that the wreck it was telling me about? It has to be. The backside of Greater Morrow. Looks like there's something over here, maybe in this gulf. Uh, there's something to dredge here. And this is where that light is maybe coming from? Is that why it's this red color? Stock is low. Start dredging. I I really enjoy the mechanic of fishing in this game, though. I gotta say. Okay, so we did get a new relic. It's a key to my heart. I hope you all accept. Put that there. That means I'll put that there. I'll put this wood here. Okay. It's been depleted, so we got that. So we did find a new relic. Just some gray eel. What's this? Just coastal, oceanic. Yep. Maybe I take a trip on the backside here. I don't know how big this map is. Oh, it's huge. There's shit over here, too. We'll do a, a little circle around the map, and then we'll head back to the Maros after we look at this and dredge that up. <laughs> yes. Some swordfish here. What is this? A gray eel? Flounder? Excuse me, your daddy has arrived. I require the dredge. This is a nice dredge trip. What do you got for me here? Oopsies. Wasn't paying attention. That's what you get for playing games when you're sick, okay? You cough, you miss shit, okay? Just let it happen. The natural course of things. What'd I get? A silver trinket? Tarnished silver bauble? I feel like I might want to hold on to a lot of this stuff. Like, maybe I will 
get more quests like that guy who was trying to find the belt of his son. Metal scraps, obviously we don't need to worry about that. Boop, boop, boop. Boop. Another metal scrap. Too bad I can't stack these. I'm pretty locked in, though. I can't... Oh. I do have four spaces here, but I don't think this king can make this happen. I just made the same shape anyways. A genius. I've made the same shape three times. Oh boy, how can I get there? Let me think. Let me see if I can do this. I don't think I can. I don't think I can. I might not just be smart enough to figure it out, though. So that's okay. That's okay. We're going to head over here. We don't have any fish on us, so I don't really need to worry about... Am I riding a current here? I was going to say, I could just go there and sleep for the, for the day, but I ain't no bitch. I don't know if this is a great idea anymore. That doesn't. Nope. Nope. That's a that's a monster. There's an angler fish in front of it. The little bastard. What's happening here? I don't know what that was, but I really wanted that. I am in a full blown panic right now. Oh my word. I better get in here. <laughs> the frick that was awful docking went dock it up all right let's go. let me go to the storage here so we're gonna this is rotting now by the way good to know put all of this garbage away just get rid of this <laughs> head back out for a dredge or two silver trinket old chain a ring the key this old master will go sell put that there okay storage workshop how about the mansion staying at the back of the room holding the silver and crimson book he looks impatient well have you found something Pursuit resolved. The ornate key removed. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head now somehow seem changed. Smaller. Has it always been this way? Is this all? Where's the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems the pieces we're looking for have traveled farther than I anticipated. Much farther, I had suspect. In that case, allow me to aid you in your travel. He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath a burst of light fills your vision and you stagger back briefly we unlock the ability haste nice otherworldly speed at a price now go my intuition tells me that the current may have carried some debris to the southeast toward gale cliffs okay you marked on the map we'll think about it nope nothing else so southeast so these must be the gale cliffs then so that's where we gotta head to sleeping because I'm a biatch undock haste adds speed to your boat but increases panic and engine heat do I care just gotta let it cool down it's not, not a big deal why would this young master panic over such a thing um, doesn't seem like anything special about the fish. I don't think. Let's get out of here. Let's keep rolling. I want to get some more dread. Oh, hole damaged. Oh, did I let it go too high? I might have. I was, I was watching the the sunset change in the background, and it really confused me. Definitely lost my sight there for a minute. That's some dredge. So, yeah, I want to be dredging all this up. We got to head back, though. We got to repair that. Start the dredge. Oops. Forgot the buttons. Come on. There you go. Wood. 
Start the dredge. Uh, finish my book. Dredge. Give me your wood, baby. That's what she said. Take it. That'll do. Okay, that's been cleaned. Definitely made a mistake with that engine. I must have overheated it. I was not paying attention. Another citrine ring. Okay, so citrine ring literally means nothing. What's that laughing I hear? You know what? That's that's okay. I don't need to. I don't need to know. It's already so late in the day. Definitely need to put this on. Oh, shit. I guess I couldn't make it through there. We're going to dredge this and go home. Yeah, we got some metal here. Perfect. Even if I just get one, I'll be happy. I'm losing some sanity. It's out. Okay. I might need to go <laughs> go back here. I better hold off on that. I don't know how much I want my panic to set in. Is that little town always over there to my right? I feel like that's a figment of my imagination and something will kill me if I go near that. So I'm not. Just like that boat over there. Oh, it gives me the same ominous feeling. I don't know if I'm going to get away from the boat this time, honestly. gotta oh geez even even overheated i couldn't do it basic fishing pole was just disabled all right it didn't make too much trouble for me it let me go but there's another one up here having that engine broken really set me back we're gonna have to fix this ship at least that boat's on its way out I don't have the, the capability to resist right now. I'm just going to sleep it off. <coughs> All right. Depart. Well, now we know what kind of happens at the night, right? Like, we're aware. And actually, just so we're <laughs> smart about this, I might as well get some fish on the way back because I'm going to need money. So let's go to the, not the research. Let me go to my storage, plop this in here, put some wood away. Injured spaces, citrine ring, all this is fine. Okay. Now we may go. This has got to be oceanic, right? Yeah, it's coastal. Get some of the good boys over here. This should be coastal as well. Oceanic works for me. I do want to stop by my Krabby Pots. I do need to... Wait. Equipment broken. Oh, okay. I was like, wait, what's happening here? So with that broken fishing rod, I can't do coastal. I could only do shallows. That makes sense. I actually quite like that. So let me come to my fishing pot here. We'll grab our crabs. Needs repair, so we'll pick that up. Grab a couple of eels, I suppose. Boop. Good fishing. Good fishing. Trophy. Got it.
Can I fit another one? Somehow, I'm sure I can. Hmm. Oopsies. There we go. That's good enough for me. That is a good enough for me. Did I? No, I don't think I ever checked what this gleam was in here. I've talked about it like half a dozen times. Never checked. Lighthouse towers above. Okay, it's just talking about the lighthouse. The lighthouse towers above. I don't care about the lighthouse. Well, I do, but I don't. Got other things to care about. Like, gonna go repair their ship and get all of our scrap. But we made a good scrap haul. And we gained information. That's some of the most important things in life is knowledge, okay? So although it came at the cost of a bit of my ship, <coughs> the lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look mm. on her face. Oh, it's you. And who were you expecting? Your engine, it sounds like, I'm sorry, I mistook it for the vessel of an old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks walks towards the lighthouse. So is it because that guy gave me the thing that makes it speed up? Like, is that why it sounds like an old friend? All right, let me do the fishmonger. Sell it all. What is this worth? 2146, not bad, not too shabby. Uh, sell all the fish. Thank you. Thank you for your, for your endeavors. Let's go to the mm. ship, right? Your boat looks a little banged up. I can repair that if you'd like. Yeah, repair all. 105 bucks. Good thing I stopped at at the shop to get some goodies there because that uh that, that took a lot out of me. So with that though. Nothing else I can really do. Halogen lights. 180 or 1800, I should say. 25 meters. Nice. Get another light aspect. We can fix that up. Let's now go to the dry dock. Remember, you don't have to keep all the materials. You can store whatever you like here. Of course I know. Two more cargo. Let's get the... Do I have... Is that metal? That's metal. Let's go to the storage. Knock that up. How much money? I've got 600 bucks. Heck yeah. A new hull. I would love to do that, but I haven't found these cloth nor glass yet. So we can hold off on that. Same with that. So we can just do this then. George, we'll use our last scrap always in there. We'll do that. What is this? Rot. The final state of all living things. Meat. So that's what fish turn into. Purchase the upgrade. All right. So we've got a light spot and we've got two more engine spaces. So one more engine space. Go to the shipwright. Oh, that's interesting. Make sure you have the specs. Okay. So if I uninstall this and turn it like like that and then I uninstall this and turn it like that a little weird to me but it works and I go to the engines and I get another one for this okay cool so there's our engines topped off that's pretty nice I'm happy with that storage we've got some wood I got a research part we can use this research we can get the flexible fishing pole for coastal and shallow spend that so now that's available in stores. <coughs> Looks like we can get the heat resistant soon. That would do volcanic and shallows, or we could get mangrove and coastal. This is coastal and shallow. I think I might get the hydraulic rod next. It's only one and that can open up oceanic fishing. So that seems to be the next move for us, as well as potentially getting the next motor after that. So let's go to the shipwright one more time. So 460 for that. Ah, that's good to know. So if I sell her, I can get rid of both, right? Co oh no, this is coastal shallow, right? Yeah, coastal shallow. Okay. So I could sell both of these for a total of about 70 bucks. I'd have just enough cash. Let's do it. Ship it. What if you can like short yourself? Like, can you soft lock yourself in this? 
install this okay and now I've got all this open space. Oh, this looks fantastic. We'll have to get a new light now that I've got the light upgrade. 275 is my next goal. Let's snooze for the night. And let's just have a fishing afternoon here. So we'll just do some, some normal things. Oh, that speed, baby. So let's just fish up everything. It's been a while since we've been here. So let's just start depleting stocks here. One reason is I want to get the aberration fish as well. Okay. Depleted. This Krabby Patty is looking pretty good actually. Take all. Nice. Uh, pick that up. Now I've got a quite a full inventory here. Do this. This is... That's flounder. That's cod. So I can't really do anything with those. So let me just head back real fast. Ah, oh, that's speed boost. It's so beautiful. Let's not break my ship this time with it, though. Good fishing day right there. These old bones will cut it out at the seas. Yeah, let's sell all that. Hundred, little over a hundred buckaroonies there. Uh, one question: What did I have for cabin things to do? Ten percent to not reduce stocks when catching reel in and more speed than listed. Nice. I don't care about the encyclopedia. The pursuit. Search for relics, of course. We gotta find the music box. Oh, it tells me everywhere I need to find it. A music box, a ring in the stellar basin. Okay. Find the belt buckle near little Maro. A place to rest. Oh, yes, that's right. We need that. And, oh, that's the fish I'm after. An aberrant fish. Okay. No, no. Wake up. I didn't mean to hit that. I wanted to look at this. Okay, cool. Ship it. Ship it out. This has been quite the lucrative day, but brothers and sisters, look, I'm always telling you, if you're loving Dredge, make sure you show that love by hitting that like button down below. It really helps out a lot. Helps us so we can find more lovely brothers and sisters like yourself, of course. And if you are new here, do think about hitting that subscribe button as well so you can always be back here for that sweet, shabby content. Ooh, we got one. Ooh, it's ugly. The Cyclopean. The Cyclopean fish. Oh, it's disgusting. I love it. A sprawling jellied mass fills from a single eye socket. What appears to be dark pupil is in fact the center of an egg. Ah, oh, it's disgusting and I love it. Oh, we can get one more. I can fit it. Got it. Now it's depleted. We can drop our Krabby Patties in here. So let me do, I didn't repair that one, but this one's repaired. So drop this down. Uh, I can probably, I get like two cod out of this or yeah, two cod will just be the best out option here. Oop, trophy. Gotcha. Yeah, one more. Good fishing, brother. Good fishing. Shh. It's really close, but there, we're not going to get that. So I have to drop that, but I didn't repair it when I went back. So that was my own fault. Uh, this is a fantastic boost. I'm really happy we got the, the nitro installed on the boat. So go back here, fishmonger. You got any of those mutants? Yeah, I do. Remember, any aberrant will suffice. I suspect they're all the same underneath. You can return these items later. Okay. Deliver. The fishmonger takes the aberrated fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. 91 bucks. Yes, this should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth. And why don't you take these too? They're of no use to me. Yep. You must take these items. Mm, do you hear that? It sounds like the faintest whispering. You, listen. 
Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguish. Please, sell what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature. Quickly now. All right, so this cod is worth 21, so good little trophy. Why not? These are all worth 15 themselves. So this cod is actually pretty big on its own. That's a good cod as well. Flounder's not worth a lot, but it was right near the base, so didn't really hurt too much. All right, now let's go over here. The fishmonger's door slams. You hear the heavy scraping of metal bar sliding across it. Let me go to the shipwright. Got a good feeling about these engines. They'll take you far away. Reliable too. Provide you take care of them. I was going to say, you didn't you didn't get anything new. It's, these engines are the same, but that's okay. We won't talk about it. Now, what I want is a quick repair. And I want to sell you 90 bucks, huh? 750 lumens. That'd be 1500, but that's more. Okay. Sell that. Install that. Thank you very much. And we got some other goodies in here to put away eventually. Got a little rod. I wonder what I can do with that. Interesting. We'll sell these. I'll hold the silver trinket and this chain until I find something similar. Like these citrine rings. Like it's like, okay, I know this isn't a potential secret item. So we'll hold off on that. Let's end this excursion today by doing a little research. Let's get a new motor. Bam. We improved the upboard motor now available in stores. I could wait until I got two more and get a big old upgrade to 26.3 knots. A jet drive engine. Interesting. Propels wa through water more efficiently than outboard motor propeller systems. Interesting. <laughs> Secrets. So three of them would give me 37 knots. Two gives me 26. That's a pretty good boost. Efficient crab pot. Yield is two to three a day. Capacity is a four by four. With improved design, this crab pot should be more effective at catching creatures. This is yields two a day, but it lasts for five days. And it's still a four by four. Then this one is a five by four. Yield is about two. The more, and then it just has more space. I don't know. I think I'm going to hold off on the Krabby Patties. And I'm going to hold this until, oh, you know what? I could. Do I care about the reel, though? Oh, we do, because I want Oceanic. Yeah, we'll get this. We'll get that. So that's available in stores. So we don't have the money for it. But what we'll do is we'll get the hydraulic rod. It'll fit right in that spot over there that's open, coincidentally. <laughs> think not so we'll be able to have oceanic coastal shallow and dredge available to us when we come back next time and then uh, we do got to make some upgrades this one doesn't need to be upgraded it's a 14.7 it's the one you start with it's fine i'll sell these two for 100 total and then we'll spend an extra 300 on top of that to get the improved outboard engines times two to add uh, just about 32 knots of speed so we'll gain about 12 knots a little less than that we'll gain about 11 ish knots probably like 10.7 or so that'll be fantastic so we'll have some good speed so we'll be ready for that so if you're excited for it make sure you're subscribed so you can be here but our right, brothers and sisters as usual this is shabby doing the rest of your day is not too shabby <laughs>